Got another big holiday coming up. It is that time of year when reds, whites and blues fill the sky. But with the scorching temperatures, we've had no rain as well. You may want to put your fireworks on pause this 4th of July. This for Tucson reporter Cristiano Ramos is live from Oro Valley to tell us what fire departments are doing to limit the number of accidental fires this year. Cristiano. Well, we've been covering several brush and wildfires throughout southern Arizona the last several weeks due to hot and dry weather. And with 4th of July just around the corner, fire officials tell me that they do have a plan in place to make sure fireworks are not causing any more fires. First, the thing is uh, that's important to note is that fireworks cannot leave the ground by Tucson law. Sparklers, poppers, and crackling or smoke balls are okay. The Tucson Fire Department is really urging the community to leave firework shows to the professionals this year to limit the amount of fires they are called out to, especially because the dry and hot weather is forecasted to persist during the holiday. TFD tells us they will have two hand crews working fallout areas from the fireworks and Tucson water to wet dry vegetation on top of mountains so it's too moist for those fireworks to set off even a small spark. And then we actually are going to have a drone with infrared so if something does happen we're flying the drone around. We can see those hot spots as they start and direct our crews to put those out before they become an actual fire on the mountain. Now, although sparklers make for a super cute Instagram pic, fireworks safety experts say that they can cause really severe burns. So you're going to want to hold them away from your clothing, your skin, and of course your kids, and always have a water resource by just like this bucket of water here. I'm going to give you a little demonstration. So let's say that this, this little sparkler was lit. You're going to want to dump that into the bucket of water until it's cool to the touch, until that sparkler is all the way out. You're going to set it aside for a couple of hours, walk away, let it chill, and then dispose of it properly later on. We'll have more fireworks safety tips coming up at five. In Oro Valley, Cristiano Ramos, News for Tucson.